Danny, you've been gone long enough. Oh, come on, one more day. Okay, half a day. Look, we'll go back tonight, late. Dad is really worried about you. And you know him, the more worried he gets, the crazier he gets. Oh, great, he gets crazier. Do you have to even ask me that? No. Come on. Let me take you home before we make Dad blow up even more than he's yeah, already going to. What are you going to say to him? I mean, you're not going to tell me we're here all night with James, are you? Guys, guys. Uh, What's going on? Sorry, I'm sorry to be the buzzkill. No, where's Danny? Something happened? No, she's okay. She's fine. Are you sure? She'll be better after she talks to you. What happened? Uh, nothing. It's cool. We didn't do anything. Nothing happened? Okay, I'm gonna go talk to her. Perfect timing, huh? <laughs> sorry, I stopped whatever was going on. It doesn't matter, man. I, you know, on the floor with our kid siblings upstairs. It's not exactly how I wanted my first time to be with Star, so... I bet. Sorry. You know, I want it to be perfect and special. It's gonna be... It's great. Uh, <laughs> since you're not mad at me, cool if I take the couch? You're still a buzzkill. You can sleep on the floor. Ah. Uh... Danny? Hey, what happened? What happened? You want to talk about it? Oh, I couldn't do it. Okay, I wanted okay. to, and I just, it's I, okay. I freaked. It's okay. No, it's not. I'm such a baby. Danny, you are not a baby. Okay, it is more grown up of you that you stopped yourself from doing something that you weren't ready to do. Your first time should be perfect. Not like mine. When Dad barged in and tore Cole off me. Yeah, just like he did to Nate and me on Valentine's Day. It was different, though. Cole and I went all the way that night. And I got pregnant. And I was so scared and confused. I wouldn't trade hope for anything, but... I wish I would have waited. Yeah, but you and Cole, you thought you were never going to see each other again. But you and Nate are going to see each other again. <laughs> I am so glad that you were smart enough not to make the same mistake I did. Don't worry. The mistakes I make will be all mine. I'm not so sure about that. What do you mean? Well, we do have the same father. And sometimes I wonder if everything I've done has been in reaction to our dad. I don't know what I'm going to tell dad about James. I'm more worried about how he's going to react to you and Nate. We've got a problem. Oh, no, wait a minute. We have to get out of here. Our mom knows where we are. What? Yeah. Wait, how? I told her last night, I am so sorry. Okay. Oh my God, if dad finds her, he is going to put the screws to her and then he's going to put the screws to us. Star, can't we just go somewhere else, please? It's only gonna make things worse. Right, so why are we doing this at all? Why do I have to go face dad if I can stay out with Nate and you guys? Why does the world have to stop? Just so that our dad doesn't throw a temper tantrum. You know what, it shouldn't, but that's the way it is. It just felt... Really good to be free from Dad, you know? Knowing that he's out there paying for what he did to Nate. Danny, did our talk last night mean anything to you? What do you mean? Like, how is everything that you've ever done a reaction to Dad? Well, I felt head over heels in love with Cole. I kind of know what that's like. When I first met him, I didn't even know that he was Marty's son. I mean, we all found out soon enough. But when Dad told me that Cole was the last person on earth he wanted me to be with, I kept right on seeing him. Why shouldn't you have? No, I, I should have. I, I loved Cole. <laughs> My whole heart and soul, I loved him. But no matter how much I loved him, I, I always felt like I was sticking it to dad 
Don't get me wrong. I, I, I would have been with him no matter what. But the fact that it made Dad crazy, a huge bonus. If you're out here to get back at Dad, then you're not free from him. You're only here because of him. And if you go somewhere else, that'll be because of him, too. Okay, all right. If we have nowhere else to go, then we'll go home and face Dad. Okay, good. And then we'll start making choices that have nothing to do with him and everything to do with what we actually want. Oh, good. You guys got everything. Yeah, I think so. Um, I, I left my cell phone. You okay? Yeah, I'm... I'm fine. I'm... Nate, are you mad at me for what happened? Oh, mad? No way! I just want to be with you. You'll be ready whenever you're ready. No pressure. Thanks. I'm just sorry we have to cut this short because my bonehead move. No, it wasn't that bonehead. I mean, you had to tell your mom that you were okay. Last night was the best night of my life. Well, until the next night we spend together. I hope it happens again soon. So do I. We better go. One minute. Taya! Come on, guys. I know it's hard to say goodbye. We don't want to say goodbye either, but the last thing we need is for my dad to walk in here and see you with Nate and me with James. Come on. <gasps>